What's up, everyone? Aaron Nagler here for PackersNews.com. I'm here with Michael Cohen. Third day in a row, he's down there in Mobile, Alabama at the Senior Bowl. Uh, Michael, I know you got to talk to new Packers general manager Brian Gutekunst today. Uh, what stood out in your uh, from your conversation? Well, one of the big things I wanted to ask him about was if he feels a need to bring in more speed to this wide receiver position. You know, I think a lot of Packers fans, especially the ones that read our website, saw, you know, that study um, that came out through an article in the New York Times that basically said of all 32 teams in the league, the Packers wide receivers play with the slowest average speed of any team out there. And so I sort of asked him, you know, does that really mean that you need to add speed? Like, is that a vital need for you guys going into the offseason? And he basically said yes, while also towing the line very intelligently and not throwing the other guys under the bus. He pretty much said that every team in the league wants as much speed as they can get, and you're always looking for it. It's one of the first things that you notice as a scout in terms of what you're trained to look for. Just the way guys move relative to others, that's one of the first things that you notice. But he also wanted to make sure that he pointed out that guys like Cobb, Adams, and Nelson, A, can be productive, B, have been productive, and C, probably still can be in, in a certain regard. And so that was a pretty interesting way of, of him saying, yes, we need it, but I still want to keep the guys that I have. Right. In regards to the Senior Bowl itself, are there any prospects kind of jumping off the field, so to speak, in the speed department? Well, there's one in particular that is probably, you know, as close to as good of a height, weight, speed prospect as, as I've seen in my three years covering the team. Now, I, before I get into it a little bit deeper, that doesn't necessarily mean by any means that he's going to be a terrific player. It just means that height, weight, speed, the three things that everyone looks at first, he's off the charts. And it's DJ Chark a wide receiver from LSU. This is a guy that's probably going to be around that third round. If he tests amazingly, he could get up into the late second. Otherwise, he could maybe drop into the early fourth. But this is a guy that's a, a hair under 6'3", weighs about 198 pounds, and runs in the high 4'3s, low 4'4s. So he gives you the height, he gives you the weight, he gives you the speed. And so far, he's looked pretty good uh, at the Senior Bowl. You know, the, some of the choppy movements that you expect from guys that – you know, aren't necessarily the most polished route runners. He was only a two-year contributor at LSU and was the number one receiver this past year as a senior. But man, in terms of height, weight, speed, and, and the way he looks on a field, you don't, it doesn't get much better than that. Well, there you go. All the latest from mobile. Make sure you're checking Michael's work from the Senior Bowl all week long at PackersNews.com. For Michael, I'm Aaron. We'll talk to you soon.